Hi, good morning. Uh, this is uh, Father Cesar Martinez. I'm the Director of Vocations for the Diocese of Stockton, and we are here. Uh, this is our Formation House, St. John Vianney House of Formation, and we're here at the chapel. Again, my main responsibility is uh, seminarians. So, uh, many, you know, walking with guys from our area or any part of the world who uh, have the desire to be priests, and then my main responsibility is to walk with them from the very moment they're, they're, they're discerning. Uh, and then when it gets more formal, applying to, to the seminary, to the diocese. And then after that, hopefully as they go to seminary, and then uh, when, once, once they get ordained. At that moment then, uh, in a way, you know, uh, my, uh, my, my process uh, has ended. Uh, however, uh, then now, now those, those guys that are now priests, and then they continue to serve the diocese. I mean, we con now we continue with them, but in a different way, different relationship. Now they, they help us as well to get more vocations. Of course, the pandemic has impacted all of us. It has been very difficult time, has been very difficult times. Uh, well, one of them, uh, the, the, the impact that we will see is, you know, usually uh, every year we get uh, these uh, very nice donations, these nice gifts from different groups. As I see uh, maybe next year, you know, usually they get these funds by doing a fundraiser or a, a dinner or something like that. But uh, most likely that next year we won't get that because um, they're not holding these events. So that's going to impact us financially. However, you know, I trust that, you know, there's so many generous people that will help us especially as we now have three guys going in into the seminary. So we will need uh, as much funds as, as we need, you know, so, uh, but also in a positive way, you know, it has impacted us. Uh, I think it has helped us because uh, young, uh, young men uh, during this pandemic uh, have realized or have asked themselves bigger questions like, why am, why am I here for? What did God create me for? Is God calling me to something else? Maybe is he calling me to be a priest? So then uh, this pandemic has uh, in a way helped us to, to help our young people to, to think about uh, those deeper questions. And then uh, we're here to help them as uh, they continue to, to discern. You know, I know it's difficult times, but uh, uh, if you can help, that will uh, greatly impact us, especially as we, uh, you know, uh, help guys so that they will, because these guys will be eventually the future priests in our diocese. So uh, it has a big impact and your financial support is very, very important. Maybe uh, we should be thinking about uh, that these uh, guys who are discerning, they will be the priests of your children, of your grandchildren, of your great-grandchildren. So, you know, uh, and we need, uh, God continues to call, you know, uh, men from our, uh, from our area and all over the world. So uh, let us pray that they will listen to the voice of the Good Shepherd and they will respond in a generous way um, to discern their call. And hopefully, uh, if, if they become ordained as priests, they will serve you uh, eventually here in our diocese as priests.